So Jason is protecting Carly. It was revealed on today's episode. But hey, y'all, welcome back to another review with Life with Chelsea for General Hospital April 2nd, 2024. Okay, so how y'all feeling? It was a lot of people saying that he was protecting Carly. Some people think that it was the time that she took over the organization. I said they must was watching her. If they must was watching her. I said, you know what? That's why Agent John kept coming around her. I said, should have known. Should have known. That's why he kept coming around her. I was like, why is he, he showing up in her face? He ain't like he was looking for Jason and all that. He was doing it on purpose. But okay, so we're going to start with Jason, Anna, and AJ and John or whatever. Let me see. I wrote it down. First, Anna was talking to Jason and she was telling him she thinks they have mutual goals. AJ and John said something about the WSB or whatever. It, they, tie, they all tie together. And I said, okay, I forgot about that. I forgot about that. And they know that mr brennan is in jail i think they showed on the preview anna was talking to him i said why would she go to talk to him why would he say anything how long do y'all think it's gonna take before she realizes that valentine is involved but agent john was basically saying he don't care about jason feelings or whatever the deal was he do what he tell him he cut off because i got a call but he was saying that jason has to do what he tells him or carly spencer pays the price and i said what leverage like what is it was it about you know when sonny was in nixon falls and she was running the organization or what I said, oh, I said, look, Jason and Carly, look, they be having each other back, though. I tell you that. In regards to Sonny, I'm confused. And I see a lot of fans confused as well. Did they say that Valentine was already doing something to Sonny's meds? Or was he going to do something to Sonny's meds? Y'all coming down below. I'm sitting in the car, y'all. The wind is blowing heavily. Oh, my goodness. But the air feel good, though. <laughs> But yeah, y'all coming down below because I seen I'm not the only one that wanted to know. Did he say he was going to do something to his meds or he already doing it? Also, do y'all think Ava is involved? Because some people saying no, she's not involved. She's just up to her own agenda or whatever. Might as well go with, I was going to go with Drew and Nina because they over here, they got something that's going to happen between them. You could tell, you could tell. But we got to talk about Carly, Jocelyn, Michael, Willow. They were just basically talking about Jason, him being bad. Carla just over the moon. She's so excited. She started, Willow brought up Drew, and she was like, she loved him, but, you know, she didn't expect Jason to come back to town. I said, it ain't supposed to go like that. It's supposed to be, I didn't expect Jason to go back to town, but I don't have feelings for him. I don't want to be with him and nothing like that. I want Drew. She didn't even try to fight. <laughs> I said, look, she did walk up to him that day, but that's the only thing we seen. I said, yeah, she still got feelings for Jason, and Jason still got feelings for her. But basically, Michael was telling Carly about jason she figured out where he had been staying and they bring up how they could tell something's different that he's been through something or whatever nina and drew so drew came in there trying to check on her or whatever and she got to talk she oh i told y'all look well i ain't gonna say i told y'all because y'all told me before i told y'all <laughs> then she never fails to mention carly's name she starts talking about carly did this to the magazine and this and that or whatever don't you want payback and he was like telling her that's your problem now <laughs> that's your problem now what has payback got in you i said right right people don't think they don't think okay i don't messed up i don't did too much i lost my daughter i lost my husband i lost my business let me do right let me do better let me show that i've changed and i learned from my bad choices because i ain't gonna say mistakes because there's a difference between mistakes and bad choices or whatever but she want to study yeah don't you want to pay back but when she started talking about jason he got real quiet then didn't he Talking about something, if it was a button you could push to make Jason go back where he came from, <laughs> you would want to push it, wouldn't you? He got real quiet talking about, so send me the article. Send me that article you working on or whatever. I said, yeah, it's only a matter of time for these two to end up together. Jocelyn and Carly end up talking about dates and I got to ask y'all, because it's been a lot of talk over social media, on Instagram, YouTube, everywhere. Do y'all think that Jocelyn's going to end up pregnant? Now, at first they were saying that Trina was going to end up pregnant with Spencer's baby or whatever, and then later on he's going to come back. Now they're saying that Jocelyn will. Jocelyn. <laughs> now they're saying that Jocelyn will or whatever. But I read the spoilers and it said that Jocelyn gets some shocking news. And I was like, that could be anything. It could be that she finds out that Dex is now a police officer or he's in the academy. He's going to become a police officer. Or it could be that she finds out she's pregnant. Because I feel like they definitely kept showing them sleeping together for a reason. Like anytime we've seen them, they've been sleeping together. I think the only time we actually saw them out and about, well, we've seen them at, I think... Was, did they go to Curtis and uh, Portia wedding and as well as the nurses ball? I don't know if they went to the nurse ball together or whatever, but I don't know if they're going to end up pregnant or not. A lot of fans were saying that she's going to end up pregnant by Dex now that she's trying to leave him or she did leave him. Then Dex, so he went to the little interview with, I wrote down his name, where it at? Detective Bennett, because y'all know yesterday I said, what's his name? But he went to the interview and Detective Bennett was like, why should he, you know, work with him or whatever why should he be allowed in the program he can't get his redemption through 
becoming a cop because he used to work for Sonny. I said, every time somebody bring up Sonny's name now, he be mad. Y'all see that face he be making? I said, you can't be that upset. You knew what Sonny did. You knew what he did. when he Did he have him hung or whatever and was beating him or had somebody beating him? It wasn't until that cost him, the whole Cyrus thing cost him his relationship with Jocelyn that he decided, oh, Sonny's a big guy. <laughs> no, I think it was when Sonny had his guards grab him or whatever. But yeah, how do y'all feel about that? Do y'all think Jocelyn's gonna end up pregnant when she finds out, if not about the pregnancy, when she finds out that he's trying to become a cop? Do y'all think that's gonna make her see him in a different light coming out below? I think the last people we got, I think the last people we got is um, Curtis, Stella, and Portia. I think we cover everybody. Let me make sure. Curtis. Yeah, we cover everybody. So we gotta talk about Curtis. Curtis, take his steps. Look, it's something he said. It's something he said that I wanna address. Let me see. I wrote it down somewhere. He's, he was talking to Stella, and he was saying how he don't want anyone to see him struggle, and basically Stella was encouraging him. And he was talking about how he doesn't want his family to he doesn't want his family to witness his baby steps. But what I wrote down, I said baby steps are better than no steps. At one point, he wasn't stepping at all, right? I said at one point, he wasn't stepping. Now he's taking baby steps, and that's a good thing. Then, you know, Stella, Portia came in. So Stella was telling him to tell her you don't want those secrets to ruin your marriage and all this stuff. So when she came back after coming out the kitchen, he was standing up. He was standing up. And I said, oh, and he started walking towards her. I said, oh, y'all know I was saying he was going to start walking when Trina got in trouble with Esme when they was in Paris. But no, nah, it didn't happen that way, y'all. But he finally started walking, y'all. But that's it. That's it. Let me know y'all thoughts. Let me Hold on. Sorry, I got distracted. I heard my niece crying. I'm finna go get her. But let me know your thoughts down below. Stay tuned for the next review. Until next time, deuces. Have a great rest of the day and be safe.